What do you call a cheap circumcision? What? A ripoff. Yes. Hey, welcome back to our stupid directions of Corbin. Ow! You can follow us on Instagram, Twitter for more juicy content. Thank you to everybody who supports us on Patreon. Yes. Follow Fisher Twitter account. Yes. Subscribe if you haven't and hit the like button. Yes. Today we have a video. This is called Six Plus Places to Visit in Megalaya. Forgive the mispronunciation. If it's uh, pronounced differently than that. Which is, I believe, right above Bangladesh. Yes. So it's one of the under, northeast. Under Assam. Got it. Uh, Megalaya is a state in northeast India. Uh, it was formed in the 72, uh, so it's right under Assam. So I'd assume All right. if it's anything like Assam, it's going to be very jungly. I would assume. Maybe it's not. Waterfally. Uh, uh, bridgy. Bridgy, for sure, bridgy. <laughs> I know my lovely wife, who isn't with us here this morning. It's her birthday. Happy birthday, my love. Uh, is probably very, very familiar with this place in terms of knowing how to pronounce it, knowing little things about it, since it is not too far away from her hometown. Hey everybody, welcome to Meghalaya. This is my favorite state in India, and I have seen it from top to bottom over and over again. These are my top six places in Meghalaya that you Meghalaya. must visit. Any stupid babies? At number from one, my God. Oh, Whoa. Look how clear the water is. Today I'm in Delhi, Meghalaya, the border of Bangladesh and India. I've always seen these videos and pictures of the glass bottom river, you know, so clear and it's been my dream to come here. Wow. Look, and I'm here today. It looks fake. Bridges. I was on that bridge before and now I'm down here. Look how clear it is. That is very clear. Wow. Are you ready to go underwater? One, two, hold your breath. That is gorgeous, this entire area. The water is crystal clear. You can see everything. It must be glacier runoff. Bottom. You can even see to be the that clear. Of yeah. My boat in the water. That's wild. Definitely worth a visit. This, my friends, is Dauki Mekhan. I would go there. India. Yep. My India. Is it one of those that you can? Or? Uh, oh, wow. No, I'm not in Thailand. No, I'm not in the Philippines. I am in my India. Office for the day. That's a gorgeous waterfall. If it's glacier water, that's probably pretty cold. Yeah. <laughs> it is freezing outside, so can you imagine what is inside? <laughs> Today I'm going to trek down 3,200 steps to go to the natural living route double decker bridges. Uh, yeah, we've seen videos Nandria, about this. Cherapunji, but not, maybe not this one because I thought that was in Assam. I did too. Maybe you're right. It's bridgey. Yeah. It's very bridgey, naturally bridgey, okay, waterfally. Okay, let's go. It's really steep. The steps are small and you can see the village way down. That would be halfway. And you're gonna have to go back up those steps. Yikes. You're above a size five, you're gonna have an issue. I'm size seven and a half. Oh and dear. I'm having a problem. 
I am above a size five, no, yes. Tamai village. So there are two ways, guys. So this way, three minutes, we see the longest single decker bridge. A living bridge, right? And then this way is the double decker. So let's can we do all these? I like bridges? that man's hat. So we we'll do the longest single decker I do too. bridge first. Keeps the sun off him really well. Just pushing your neck. Oh wow. So beautiful. This is stunning. I've never seen anything like this before, have you? Wow. Alright guys. I'm about to step on the longest living root bridge in the world. This bridge is natural. It's from the rubber tree roots. Look, this is what we're walking on. So the Indian rubber roots, they go down and these guys direct the roots and make it a bridge. What That's a so national cool. treasure. Even more treasury than treasury bala. What bridge are you crossing right now? Because whatever bridge you cross, you will come out on the other side. That's such a cool thing that they've done in India with those bridges. They're yeah. so cool. Tired? No. <laughs> Nobody wants to admit to being tired. Are you tired? I'm tired. <laughs> How do you feel? Very nice. <laughs> it feels you? Awesome. <laughs> awesome and tired. First double decker, oh my god, right here. So pretty. Oh, wow. Oh, wow, it's a double decker. That's so pretty. To get to this double decker bridge. It's got to be hundreds of years old to be that looking like that. Does that mean I have to climb 3,200 steps to go back? Yes, it does. How they thought about doing that. Of That's so cool. Ten out of ten would go. A waterfall? This waterfall? Where there's a waterfall? Rasta ka hai? This way, can you show me? My friends showing me the way to the waterfall today. Use of offensive language not allowed. Bye bye. Thank you for showing me the way. Bye bye. Meghalaya is full of these really scary hikes to waterfalls. Wish me luck, guys. Oh, wow. You can finally see it. The best. Oh, wow. Oh, God. Oh. Oh. <laughs> That's a great life lesson. To get anywhere beautiful, you gotta take a rough road. Not me. We are entering the Kong Thong village. Also known as the bikini worn by a giant Listen gorilla. Carefully, because I am in a village Kong Thong. where get people call each other by singing. They're calling out to each other. These are their names. This is called the Whistling Village. Oh, wow. Where each person's name is a little tune. I thought it was a bird. What's your name? Cuckoo. What's your name? Cuckoo. What's your name? Cuckoo. I'm in the Whistling Village. There are a lot of villages around Meghalaya. Really? Where people's That's names awesome. are songs. So when they were born, What's my name was their mother song? looked at them in their arms and whatever song came out of her heart, that is beautiful. She sang it and that became his name and his name. And what's the long form of your name? Because their names are full songs. They're not just short. So that was the short form of their name. What's your full name? How do you write that for your taxes? Name, like a singing name. No, I'm not a composer. <laughs> <laughs> What's your name? Oh. 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 What's your name? <laughs> I feel left out because I have such a boring name. My name is just 
shit, guys. Can you name me? No. <laughs> what's your name? What's your name? That's awesome. What's your name? What's your name? He doesn't want to tell me his name. That happens sometimes. Hello. Oh. <laughs> I just want to know what's his name? Let me learn how you, you teach me your name. This is so fascinating. <laughs> The kids play football from this age, huh? Football is big over here in Meghalaya. That's not football. <laughs> There's another thing about this village. It is so clean and so pretty. There is nothing around. They don't litter at all. There are dustbins everywhere. It's a beautiful, clean, spotless, Singing village. If you could name your best friend with a singing tune, what would that tune be? Write in the comments. Alright, today I'm gonna How would enter I write that in the sacred comments? forest. <laughs> this is the angel of the forest. Yo, what do they do for their taxes? Excuse me. Hi, can you tell me the significance of this place? This uh, place is known as a uh, mouth flower. Okay. So these are monolith, they are represented for the ritual. Okay. So this standing one is represented as a man or okay. a male. Okay. The third one that are sitting is for female. Right? The female is really important in the Khasi culture, yeah, right? They are the more powerful here in the Khasi culture. Nice, I like that. Welcome, Welcome to, to the, the sacred, sacred forest. forest. But Shinas, remember, this is untouchable forest. Untouchable forest? What yes. does that mean? You can leave any footprints and take any memory. That means I can't take anything from the forest away. Yes. All right. That should be all forest, by the way. Okay, this tells you the direction of where. In the enchanted forest, this is really beautiful. What is this place? Uh, this place is a room for the family of Richard. Okay. Sacrifice bulls. They sacrifice bulls over there. What place is this? So the king is crowned over here in the sacred forest. And this place smells really good and breathing in a lot of oxygen. <laughs> mm. If I take something out of this forest, what will happen to me? A curse will follow to you. A curse will happen if you take anything out of this forest. I like that. This is a sacred forest. Will you come in? You're respectful, you leave with good luck as and good Like you said, as every forest should be treated. Everything in nature, it, really. If you take things from it, this is called the untouchable forest. You will suffer bad luck and a bad home. I like it. So, so this is the exit point, and we're, we're gonna come out from the forest, and we just wanted to make sure that you're not taking anything from the forest. Batter down. No, I'm not taking anything. Just leave here. Check her pockets. Oh. <laughs> Bottom of her shoes. Yeah. Better make sure nothing happens yeah. on me. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Leave only footprints, take back only memories. What do you have to say about that? My friends from Meghalaya have something to say. Feeling adventurous, come, come to Meghalaya. Yeah. What a great video. Wow. Well so done. many in one obviously just the nature in general that she saw was oh I would go to every single nature's my favorite place to be in same I like my, garbage same with my wife yeah I, I prefer to be on refuse dumps lots of plastic concrete nature's overrated I mean why do we need nature well you are a New Yorker yeah <laughs> <laughs> yeah I uh, not, few things bother me more in life than to be on a hike or to be on a beach anywhere that's natural and to see human beings have left crap there that all they had to do is pick it up like themselves yeah it's 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 i don't understand that level of disrespect um but also the singing village is awesome extraordinary i love that concept of that that is that everyone's name is a song what, whatever when your mom's holding you whatever song comes into her head is your name it's a beautiful concept i love that uh um, and not only that it becomes not not only that it happens at the day of your birth but it remains so that when your name is called it's a song i, I had no idea such a thing existed how do fascinating 
maybe they just have been used to it. How do they remember it? Repetition. I'm sure it's just repetition. Mm. No, I'm saying like the mom right at the beginning. Mm -hmm. So you look at the baby, and there's a long form. Right. Maybe it's just because they've been doing it for so long that yeah. it's easy and I think, for them. I, I think it's a just it's a constant like I, it's just singing over and over and over you're, again. My child's born. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> the Jurassic Park thing. Yeah. Um, well, when Anakin Skywalker was born, mom went dun dun diddly dun diddly diddly dun dun. <laughs> Dun diddly dun diddly diddly dun. I love dad came in and went dun 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 dun. Great. Yeah. Uh, I love the concept though. I do too. It's amazing. I, and then obviously just treating nature respectfully is what it should always happen. Yep. Yeah, it's like my favorite place to be. Uh, is going on a hike with my wife and my family. Um, that's basically all what we do if we go out. If we go out. We don't. <laughs> yeah. And my, I, thankfully. Do you guys my, go on a lot of hikes? Or? Thankfully, my wife is of the same uh, love and disposition as myself in regard to the places we like to go. When we're going to go do something where we're having some fun mm -hmm. and being adventurous, we actually, she's a city girl and I love being in the city. So we love to go and do things in the city. But for recreation and rest, the beach. Every day of the week, man. We love the beach. The beach is nice. Yeah. I prefer Absolutely love the beach. Hikes. Anyways, great video. Uh, if anybody is from Mag... Magalia. If, forgive the mispronunciation, obviously. Any stupid babies yeah, are from there, please let there. us know in the comments. I know it's obviously... Is there is there a film industry in that region? I don't know. Please let us know down below. Just